In a consumer alert, while no cases of avian flu have been reported in UP dairy cattle, Upper Michigan farmers must still abide by state guidelines. TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Barbara Bellinger spoke to a UP dairy farmer who shares how he and other farms are continuing to ensure their cattle remain healthy and their products safe to consume. Senator Ed McBroom's family owns Melody Dell Dairy in Vulcan. The farm has around 300 dairy cattle. I enjoy working with the cows and seeing the new calves and raising up the next generation. But McBroom says he's had to change a few things to comply with new state-ordered dairy farm protocols related to the bird flu outbreak. I have to have a cleaning, sanitizing station. I put up signs in various places to help visitors know where my biosecurity perimeter is. According to MDARD's website, bird flu was first detected in Montcalm County in March. Since then, it's been reported in 12 counties, including one more downstate county yesterday. But the department says the state is past the initial surge. Well, we're certainly much in a much different phase of HBAI here in Michigan than what we were earlier this year. We've only had a handful of detections of dairy farms since really early July. Boring says dairy farmers' compliance with risk reduction measures has helped. McBroom says there was some initial confusion, but farmers now understand what the state is looking for. It's gone pretty painlessly for most of us, and uh, certainly because we don't have the disease here, it's been a little more relaxed. McBroom wants dairy consumers to be assured about one thing. Pasteurized milk remains 100% safe to drink. Barbara Bellinger, TV6 News, Vulcan.